Hello everyone! In this video, I'm gonna talk about the fastest shots in the history of soccer. These shots are so fast that if they hit a nearby person in the head, they could kill them. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video. Your support is very important for me. First on our list is David Beckham's goal against Derby. In 1996, Beckham was only 21 years old, but he was doing justice to his jersey. Despite his young age, Beckham showed great courage and took a great shot outside the penalty area. The goalkeeper touched the ball but couldn't deflect it. This shot entered the goal at a speed of 130 kilometers per hour. It's really unbelievable. Second on our list is Obafemi Martins goal against Tottenham. The Nigerian footballer's shooting speed was 136 kilometers. Martins, oh, what a goal! Martin's leg length is not very long. Normally, muscular and long-legged footballers score hard shots. Martin's is 5 FT7 inches, 170 centimeters tall. It is unbelievable that he was able to shoot this hard shot. Turkish footballer Tugay Karamoglu is a Blackburn legend. He finished his career at Blackburn. During his playing career, he refused transfer requests from other teams. In 2001, he had just arrived at Blackburn. In one of his first games, he sent a shot at Southampton with a speed of 138 kilometers. There was nothing the goalkeeper could do. He scored a great goal and became the favorite of Blackburn fans as soon as he arrived. Carlos was the right back that every team wanted, so much so that we can call him the best right back in history. He scored exactly 97 goals in the matches he played, and he scored most of these goals either from free kicks or with hard shots from distance. He had his own unique free kick technique. Even now, many footballers can't use free kicks like him, even though they try. Carlos was in the Brazilian national team in 1997. In a match against France, Brazil won a free kick. Carlos took the ball and sent it into the net with a special shot like the one I told you about. So much so that even the goalkeeper had a hard time seeing it. The measured speed of this shot was a 140 kilometers. Who knows? Maybe more. If you notice, even the camera has a hard time detecting it. Alan Shearer scored a very hard goal against Leicester in 1997 for Newcastle. His shooting speed was not measured during the match. Later, they said that it entered the goal at a speed of 142 kilometers. It was really a tremendous shot. Shearer is famous for scoring a lot of goals as well as shooting from distance. He never played in any league other than the Premier League during his career. He scored 361 one goals in total. Considering that he played in the Premier League, this number of goals is really tremendous. Matt Letizia was playing for Southampton in 1997. His team faced Newcastle United in the Premier League. A few games before that, Alan Shearer had scored a goal by shooting at Leicester at 142 kilometers per hour. Matt Letizia took revenge on Leicester. He shot at the Newcastle goal at 143 kilometers an hour. Tissier scored a great goal. Up to this point, shooting speeds usually increase by one or two points. But Richie Humphreys has really opened the gap. At 154 kilometers per hour, his shot was amazing. That's 11 kilometers faster than Tissier, who is ahead of him in the rankings. That's tremendous. David Trezeguet was playing soccer for Monaco in 1997. His team faced Manchester United, one of the giants of the Premier League, in the Champions League. Trezeguet not only scored the winning goal for his team, but also scored one of the fastest shots in the history of football. The measurement result shows that Trezeguet's goal into the Manchester Nets was at a speed of 155 kilometers. David Beckham was at the top of our list, but Beckham entered this list with two different goals. This time, his goal is 27 kilometers faster than his previous goal. He also scored the previous goal from close to the penalty area. This time, he scored from a free kick. Ed Degoe, the legendary goalkeeper of that period, could not save the ball he sent to the Chelsea Nets at a speed of 157 kilometers. When we look at the photos of David Hurst when he was a soccer player, we can say that his physique is very good. He has a muscular build. In 1996, Hurst was playing for Sheffield Wednesday. Now this team is in the second division of England, but in 1996, it was a Premier League team. Hurst's shot, unlike the others, was inside the penalty area. Such a hard shot could have injured another player at close range. 
The speed of the shot was 186 kilometers. The sound it made when it hit the post echoed throughout the stadium. This is the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. See you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video. Goodbye.